Hey guys, and in today's new video, I'm going to be reviewing the Spare Halloween 2023 Heckles the Sad Clown. So, let's get straight into it. So, what we have here is this depressed, well, depressed or sad looking um, clown that's holding a red balloon. And the red balloon uh, changes, has like at least three different faces that it projects inside, which is very cool. While while Heckles moves his head side to side and his mouth moves as well with his realistic looking face. This particular um, this particular guy was sold at Spirit Halloween for $279.99. Which, for the price, I mean, in general, the clown is amazing. But for the price-wise, it's overpriced. For what you're getting, like, I get it. It's modern spirit. Of course, prices are, prices have to go up and stuff. But at least make him do more movements or something. Like, make his, I don't know, make, make his other arm move or make the arm with the balloon move. Like, for $280, it was, it was too much. Like, this guy should have at least gone for, like, $230 and something something like that i will it would have been more understandable since prices have gone up where he could have been priced at 230 instead of like 280 um for that price he could have just bought mr dark or or emmeline or darling dolly for that price and they do much more jump scares than, than this clown but anyways besides the price i love him in general when spirit first um leaked uh, released his video and stuff of like him in the in the video with all of the other animatronics he caught my attention the most like i love when spirit makes sad clowns like they made uh waving wally and he wasn't that sad like he was more like vintage type but he wasn't sad or anything but he was very cool and i wish i have him in my collection maybe someday in the future i could find him and Mercari or eBay for cheap, and I would love to have them alongside with Heckles the Clown. But anyways, Heckles the Heckles immediately came a popular animatronic that everyone just had just that everyone just had to get. However, upon receiving them in the mail and stuff, people received deformed looking heads. Very, very bad. Because Spirit at the time didn't um, like I don't know tell SVI or something to make molds under the mask, so to avoid any deformities, so that's what happened. Every heckles that every heckles that arrived to people's homes came with a deformed face. Some worse than others. Some were decent, but just needed a little touch up fix. But um, yeah, they were very bad. So Spirit decided to recall them and they just sent out replacement heads to everyone. To everyone that ordered a Heckles, which was a very nice thing for them to do. However, a new problem, a, a new problem, th that problem still wasn't over with because the heads that they sent out to people and the Heckles that they brought back in stores updated with the with the face mold in the in in the head and stuff yeah the, the the latex rips so people thought like people started selling the 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 original heads and everything like the deformed heads and they start throwing them away and stuff but in reality you should have stayed with them because now the new heads are worse than the deformed ones because now the latex on these ones rip very easily Mine's does not show any sign of ripping, but I'm going to avoid that because I'm going to have to not, I'm going to have to unplug the wiring that goes for the mouth movement. I may have to unplug it because I really don't want the mask to start ripping. And there's been many videos of people owning him and even in stores of his face ripping in the mouth area. So... Yeah, the spirit is going to have to, you know, do... If they do bring him back in stores, they're going to have to really update his face once again. Because it's having... it's The issues are not done and over with just yet. 
So for this, so for mines, um, I used them for Halloween. He barely went off, which was a good thing. Um, and especially till now, I've barely used them. Like now in this video, you're gonna see him going off. But what I do is I'm gonna I'm gonna have to unplug the mouth movement, and just have his head move side to side and the balloon light up and stuff. Because I really don't want to risk the mask breaking and ripping and everything. And mines, I was lucky. So I found this heckles, I believe October 28th or something, at one of my local spirits. It was the only one in the box, brand new. And luckily I went there, I picked it up, brought it home. The face wasn't deformed at all, thank God. And yeah. His det the detailing in the face is way better than the first deformed heads that came out. Way, way, way better. Like, I love... It, like, if you were to put some perma blood or something right there, that will look really cool on his cut. They did a very good job. The face looks realistic as well. He has no light-up eyes, which, to be honest, I love light-up eyes. So I kind of wish he had them. But, anyways... He doesn't have them. Oh well. His hair is very good as well. You could obviously fluff out the hair more. His clothes is very good as well. He has this cool sign that says balloons, 10 cents. The My favorite part is a projector in the balloon. Like that's my favorite part. I love how it changes different faces. Setup wise, very easy. Nothing difficult. Typical SVI. There's never there's there's never a hard setup with them. Um so yeah, I truly hope I've been hearing rumors that there may be a clown theme for spirit at in uh 2024 now. So if there is, I'm praying that Heckles does make a return. I love him, I truly do, and I hope they update his face. So the latex doesn't rip or anything. Like, I hope they do that. If they, if they were to bring him back in stores, which there could be a possibility. However, since the, he was recalled and they shipped out the new ones later on, um, it's, it's difficult. Like, online, he sold amazing when he was first released. But then in stores, you know, he barely sold. And whenever they got any... It was towards the end of the season. So there's a possibility. There's a 50-50 that he could be coming back in stores for this year, which I hope. So anyways, I'm going to go plug him in. And you're going you're gonna to see him doing all of his movements and everything. So just give me one sec. <clears throat> my clown troop? You have a pretty funny face. I bet you'd be a natural. <laughs> I'll let you know the details. It's all a bit up in the air. Uh, better buy a balloon in the meantime, kiddo. Oh, you still don't want it? That makes me a sad clown. <laughs> And even the way um, Heckles is standing, you rarely uh, see like clowns in this type of posture right? at all, of like animatronics. You always see them standing straight. <laughs> Come on, buy a balloon already? You can have any color balloon you'd like. No? <laughs> then buzz it off, why don't you? <laughs> I just love this guy. Every day is a happy day for a balloon. Here, take one. 
<laughs> They're even nice on your death day. <laughs> Guys, Heckle's a clown, and I truly hope you guys enjoy. Hold on, I'm fighting with the adapter. So, this is Heckle's a clown. I truly hope you guys enjoy him a lot. I truly enjoy him. I believe he is still available on Spirit Halloween's website. So, if you really want him, go buy him now. Um, do I recommend him? Yes, I still recommend him. Even though he's 280, I still recommend him a lot if you're a big, massive fan of him. Um, I'm praying he comes back for this year as well in stores because he definitely deserves a redemption being in stores. Last year, what he did so good online, but you know, there were a few little bumps here and there and he, he came back only for or towards the end of the season. So I really hope he, he makes a massive return in stores and he sells great again. So yeah, this concludes its video. I hope you guys enjoy it. More to come soon.